Oh, there you are. Just seeing referral. This is Jamie. How may I help you? Hello. Hi. 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 Um, my, I'm, I'm, I feel a little silly calling right now, but I have a German Shepherd. Uh huh. And um, he got. We usually don't let him into our room. Um, mm -hmm. But my boyfriend and I went to go see a movie, and we had somebody, one of our uh, nieces was over pet sitting, and she didn't know mm -hmm. that he wasn't allowed in our room. And he ended up, uh, he he went into our in our dresser drawers, and mm -hmm. we had a um, we had a bottle of flavored lubricant in there, mm -hmm. and okay. the dog chewed the end off of there, and it's the warming kind. Yep. And he ended up eating the whole bottle. Um, oh. he's just he's drooling a lot, and um, I guess there there was uh, some toys in there that uh -huh. like a um, it's like a thing it's like a necklace kind of with beads on it, but they're kind mm -hmm. of larger beads. Mm -hmm. And he I got ate, you. He ate them, <laughs> so. Um, oh no! Oh yeah. my god! Yeah. Okay. Um, where are you located? Oh, no. I'm sorry. He's he's throwing up. Let me put my my boyfriend on the phone. Okay. Yeah. No problem. Can you take the phone? No. No. Don't throw up on the carpet. No. Into the go in the kitchen. Elky, honey. Bye. I'm sorry. I'm trying to get him on the phone. No, that's no, okay. No. Deal with deal with the the phone. Deal with the phone machines. I know. So I got. I got. I got the phone in the other room. Okay. All right. I'm gonna. I'm gonna put it down here. No. Don't. Not on the carpet. Uh, he's just. He's vomiting all over the he's, place. Okay. Is he vomiting the the toys as well? The toys. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Your your um boyfriend said that he's vomiting or he ingested the toy. Yeah. The toys. Yeah. It looks like cereal and toys. Oh. Okay. Oh, cereal like his food? I think so. I think he, he must okay. have been getting into our cereal, apparently. Oh, no. He just, like, eat everything. <laughs> our, oh, my God. It looks like there's glitter in there. Like some glitter. Oh, no. Okay. Where do you guys live? Where do we live? Yeah, because I'm trying to find the closest hey. hostel to you. If we're the closest, then I would recommend coming here. Honolulu. Okay. Are you guys where in Copy Olani? We're on Kapiolani, yeah. Okay. Um, I think you're the closest to us because um, we have a little house on the beach. Um, okay. So I, I think you're going to be the closest. Um, do you, I, I'm trying to stick – he keeps sort of biting me, and I know he doesn't mean to because, you know, he's kind of – he looks – he's acting like really out of it. But I'm trying to right. make him throw up, so I'm trying to like stick my fingers down his throat, you know? And he keeps kind of mm. biting, biting me. Can you try, honey? Um, the way that you would actually have to do that is you have to give him medication. Okay, like like Xanax. No, 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 not Xanax. Um, it's actually like to induce vomiting. It's a liquid um, injection that, that we would give here. What's that stuff that you take before the drag shows, Elky? Uh, I can't remember the name. It starts with like a Z or something. Yeah, it's like Xenadrin or something, and it makes you throw up and you lose a bunch of weight real fast. Uh, no, I wouldn't e recommend using any Epicaf? human products on Epicaf? Um, Yeah, I wouldn't I recommend know. using any human products on him because he's already, we don't know how much of, of everything that he ingested. He eats human food, though. We, yeah. We feed him steaks. Not, but not human medication. Potatoes. There's there's like a huge difference Green beans. and some me medication can't be actually metabolized by dogs beans. he drank a two liter of coke once okay <laughs> okay he didn't this time though right no because he probably would probably yeah. kill me if he did he also ate batteries yeah. one time and they never came out i'm thinking maybe the coke dissolved the batteries or something else. well no pe oh that's part super of bad did. the little the little end piece on the nine volt came out but oh, I, the rest okay. of it didn't <laughs> That's good. Okay, did you guys want to bring him in? How much is that going to cost? Does our insurance cover uh, it? Um, your insurance will probably cover it for pet insurance, but um, no, no, if you I'm, have pet I'm through with United Healthcare. Um, no. Well, can I, he's he's a dependent. Um, it 
will not cover that. Are you, are you like a hundred percent certain or is there somebody that you could ask? Cause I mean, I, um, I pay extra for him on my entrance. I think, isn't it? It's like a copay of $30. I think. Yeah. Right? Like a dependent. Yeah. No, unless you have like an insurance claim form that you can bring in from here. But the thing is, like, he's, he's the executor of my estate, too. He's in my will. Like, I'm pretty sure that he has my power of attorney, so I, he should be covered. Your dog. Yeah. His, well, he's like a member of our family. Right. He's just Graham. Yeah, his I understand. Graham Wellington. What's that? I, I'm just telling you his name. Graham Wellington is his he, name. Oh, was the okay. the bear at our wedding. It was like mm-hmm. the most gorgeous thing you've ever seen on the beach. Streamers, tiki torches. Both of our families flew in. It was wow, it was magical under the sun. It was nice. It was. That's awesome. Yeah. Um, but if you wanted to bring him in here, it, it's an emergency um, exam of one hundred and five, and then any additional, um, if they're going to need to take X rays or induce vomiting that would be additional to that okay can we if we make him vomit before we get there would it be any cheaper um not necessarily because we don't know how much he ingested what he ingested um and if he's still feeling um unwell then we may have to induce vomiting again okay well what would they give him just theoretically and i know i know you're not the doctor but like you know what like, do they give him like dog morphine or something? Um, no, it's it's a um, it's a emetic. Yeah, we need the medic strictly for dogs, like so it's an injection. Oh, like the doctor, the emetic, like electronic medicine. Or? No, no, no. Um, it emetic is for like vomiting, a, a medication for vomiting. Yeah, like, um, like in Star Trek Voyager, like the holographic. No. No, no. So, like, um, when you say vomiting, it's like to induce emesis. And so, emetic is like the word for. No, no, my niece was the one that was watching him. The dog is the one that ate the stuff. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, when you. You said my niece's, right? No. When you you uh, give a dog medication, it's called emesis. Do you know what she's E-M-E-S-I-S. talking about? Oh, I've never heard of that. Unisis. Un- Unisis. Yeah, that's in Unisis. to vomit. Unisys. Un- Unis- Unisys is like, isn't that like some software company? Do they, um, I'm not sure. Unisys. Did you folks want to bring him in? Yeah, do, how do we make him an appointment? Um, because we, it's just coming through in the, like the emergency room. Well, so we, you will come in at any time. Okay, but um, I think we, he's available. We're we're we were just coming back from the show, so we've had a few drinks. We might have to have um, our friend David drive us. Okay. Um, do, yeah. What time, what time do you guys David. close? I'm David, we're just, we told him about the what? dog eating yeah. the lube, throwing up. Oh man! Yeah, it's yeah, we're open twenty four hours a day. Twenty four hours. Okay, good, good. David, do you have like a sheet that you can lay in the back of your of your car? Yeah, I got a plastic sheet. Okay, we got a plastic sheet. What's a good thing? How do we make him not have diarrhea? Because he's been having. We would give him medication for that. No, but he's doing it right now. We want him to stop. Like, Elkie, do you have, like, what is that other thing you use for the drag shows that make you, it makes you stop going poop? Uh, butt plug? Yeah, do we, can we, um, if, if there's a small one, uh, would it hurt the dog if we use one? Um, yes, I wouldn't recommend doing that. Can I slap the dog a few times to encourage him to not shit? He's going to mess up my car. Like if it's not then hard. Maybe you should take he a different a car, nice car or... or yeah, you know what we'll do? Put, we'll put his leash out the window and he'll walk um, on the outside of the car. We'll just yeah, drive slow. I drive real slow anyway. Yeah, we'll just like maybe put him on the bumper or something. Or can we strap him to the roof of the car? Then if I drive real fast, all this shit will just fly back. Maybe we can make him a diaper. Like, do you have one of those those thongs that you wear for the drag show? It's small, so it'll probably fit him. Plus, the, the behind area is already cut out. Mm-hmm. 
Do you think that would work? Because because my my husband does drag shows, you know, or the assless uh-huh. ones, right? Yeah, and they have the behind area cut out because that's what the guys like to see: his milkshake, you know, and his his they like to hear his booty clap. He's got a broken I, ass. I do have a good one, yeah. So what we could do is maybe like if we put a bunch of tissues in there. Um, no. And I'm since not. it's an emergency, we can run red lights, right? No. Are you sure? I have some glow sticks we could stick out the side of the... Yeah, to maybe you like... You can twirl them around. Do you... And then do you... I'll go out and go... Yeah, we can make the siren noise. Um, do the other people listening, like, do they have any suggestions for us? Like, are you consulting with your colleagues? Is that why we're on speaker? Um, no, I need to know if this is a real call or not. Oh, this is a 100% real call. If you are going to come down, then I, I would recommend coming down now. Okay. Does, does the person that's listening, maybe we could consult with them? Um, Cause we, I, okay. Is that Hold your on, supervisor? Hold on. Hurry up. Hurry up. I like the idea of like having your car strapped to the roof with assless chaps and <laughs> glow sticks out the side of the car. But if you drive really fast, then the car behind you gets all the shit. That's a good idea. Hi, how can I help you? Hi, um, is this the, the supervisor? Oh, uh, yes. We were just um, transferred to you because we were telling her um, our dog, my niece was watching him. He got into our dresser where there was um, some flavored lubricant. The dog ate it. Uh, he's He had eaten some beads as well, and he's vomiting and defecating. She had suggested that we bring him in, which is fine. We had some questions about insurance, which she answered. She was very kind. Um, but we were just concerned about um, David. Um, my friend was going to drive us because we had been drinking. So okay. we were going to put the dog in its kennel, but strapped. he drives a Mini Cooper. So no. we're going we to put it in its kennel on the roof, right, David? Right. And then... Because it's, it's a new Mini Cooper. It's a new car. And then we're going to hold um, put glow sticks on the windows so people know to get out of the way. Um, and then... They, she was saying that we can't run red lights. Mm, I can't advise you to do that. If you choose to do that and get a ticket, that's, you pay all, the ticket that's all on you. Is your, but yeah, we're ticket, not responsible right? if you get a ticket. Well, no, that's okay. I have orange and yellow ones. So. They're orange and yellow glow sticks, so it's kind of like emergency colors. But we've had yeah. this dog. I was telling her he was the ring bearer at our wedding, and he's he's very dear to us. He's like a member of the family. He's in our will. Mm-hmm. You know, we don't want him to, to you know, be in danger. Um, then I wouldn't worry if you have a brand new Mini Cooper. I would, if if you really don't want to put him in your car, you can take hey, a pet friendly car. taxi. It's not our car is the thing. It's my car. It's David's. So, like, what if we put his leash out the window and we just drive slow? And could he walk by the side of the car? I don't advise that either. But is I there any way to put him on, like, a little cart? And then we pull the cart behind us. Like a, like a, like a wagon I would advise trailer. you to get a pet-friendly taxi. Oh, uh, is there a way to make what him stop pooping, maybe? Um, no, you have to get medical treatment for your dog. So what area are you coming from? Um, are you familiar with um, Honolulu? Where in Honolulu? Yeah, and you guys are in Kapiolani, right? Mm-hmm, but where in Honolulu are you coming from? Because there so, may be another hospital that you can go to. We're right up the street. Do you Ma'am? know where Amana is? Amana Street? Can I ask her mm. a question? Yeah, go ahead, David. Yeah, I just found one of me them radio flyer wagons, and I got a roll of duct tape. How about we put the the dog in the radio flyer wagon, and I duct tape them in, and then we hook it up to the back of my Mini Cooper. I wouldn't advise that. You could put a, like a sheet, a uh, plastic sheet over him so he stays warm. Yeah, no, I don't advise that either. So if you want to come down, yeah, you we're can on try a pet street friendly taxi. You know where Kanunu is? Uh, no, I'm not familiar where that is. Uh, I know where Amana Street is. Makaloa? But you're. Mm hmm. Okay. Oh, so you could walk. Did you want to walk here? That's what we might do. Can we ride the dog? Mm-hmm. You know, like he's, <laughs> we probably couldn't ride the dog. Like, 
Um, we she was saying that they have to make the dog throw up to give him a unisys. Mm hmm. Um, like, and she said that it might save money if we if he vomits before he gets there. Um, is there like a something that we can give the dog to make him throw up before we get there? I don't advise it because you don't know what what else he got into. Um, because we my have best advice pills. to you is to come down. I yeah, I don't advise you to give him dog. any anything over the counter. Anything that you can give to what humans, you just need to get here. D David had a question. It's what organic. About mushrooms? I heard him, and I advise you that you need to come. I have in. some magic mushrooms, and they're not over the counter. We keep them in the fridge. Okay. Are you going to come in or not? Yeah, yeah, we're definitely going to come in. Um, I think we're going to walk him down now. Because, I think that we're going to feed him some of the mushrooms first. Yeah, because he needs to throw up. Um, we might have him take a, a look at that picture of Amy Schumer naked um, because we need him to vomit. And then... <laughs> <laughs> I think her coworker wasn't sure. I think she was like confused. <laughs>